So, it's that time again, peak of the week. Got a new review this week. It is from the Beer 52 pack again. Honestly, it's probably one of my favourite breweries. These do a lot of nice beers. Amundsen Brewery, very international one. I, I, off the top of my head, I couldn't tell you where they're from, so give me two seconds while I just have a quick read of the back. I feel like they're Amsterdam way, or I might be wrong, Norway, Norway. But, genuinely, like these do a lot of good beers. They stick in my head because they always do, as you can see, the good can design. But the quality is very, very good, like. I've not had it yet, so I'm going to flip round to this. As you can see, it's a, a light looking beer, a bit of a pale ale. It's called a modern ale. I don't know whether that means they've gone American hop heavy, because obviously Americans limited their hops for a long time and give rise to the birth of craft beer. Um, and then craft beer swept the world. Um, it smells very nice, it smells, I feel like I always say it's, it's fruity, it is fruity, what kind of lockdown on it? Now, for me that's that's kind of sweet fruits, it's a bit peachy almost, um, yeah. So as, as a sweet, as a beer, it's got a very well balanced mouth feel, like it's got that heavy feel to it which you want from an IPA but it's very well balanced. The sweetness is a bit of floral notes underneath, a bit of grass, um, colour wise it's, it's strawberry, uh, straw sorry, yeah good, honestly. I'll heavily rate this brewery. It's a Norwegian one, it says in the end, then, yeah? They're very good. I'll rate them. That beer in itself is not the best that I've had from them. But that's in a scale of one to amazing, isn't it? Like, so, as a beer itself, very, very, very good. Like, mouthfeel brilliant, floral tones, well balanced. Yeah, we're good for that.